Hey video creators, I'm going to be transparent with you today and share with you guys exactly how much uh, a couple of videos make for me. Uh, stay tuned. Hey folks, creators, YouTubers, welcome back to Pine Meadows Hobby Farm. I'm your host, Jerry Hansen. I have been um, creating video content for about seven years now, and it took me a while to uh, finally get a video to um, go do something, but it took a while to get enough viewers to be able to monetize in the first place. So, you know, starting a YouTube channel, it's a slow process. The reason why I talk about this is because one of my uh, friends and fellow YouTubers started a channel and was trying, you know, struggling, trying to, you know, figure out what to expect, how to get it growing. So I'm not gonna tell you how to get it growing because I don't know. Uh, mine grows because of a fluke. Don't know how it happens, a fluke. So in this video, I'm not going to talk about the homestead or homesteading, but I'm going to talk to you about uh, the videos that involve the homestead. I know about my garden, but we're going to talk about basically the top 10 videos that are trending on my show. And uh, I'm going to show you what each video has made since I uploaded them. And that way you can get an understanding of uh, how much money you can make once your video catches the audience's attention. Okay, the top 10 videos, I'll give you the name of the video, and over the lifetime of the video, how many views they've had, and then we'll go over how many, how much money each video has made for me over the course of time. So How a Poor Man Can Buy Cheap Property is a show I filmed after we filmed, wrapped up shooting a reality TV show for Discovery Channel, which we were invited to do. It was an interesting uh, adventure for us. But the show hadn't gone live yet, but I produced this video. The video went, and boy, it caught on and went gangbusters, as you'll see right here. It was How a Poor Man Can Buy Cheap Property. Now, this video I produced was a mistake. I meant to produce the video with all of the ins you know, insets in it, but this is the raw video without the insets. So this is How a Poor Man Can Buy Cheap Property version A. And mind you, it was a mistake. It was the raw, raw video. It wasn't even the full video. The full video with all the uh, added features on it is How a Poor Man Can Buy Cheap Property version B. I'll leave the links up here at the end of the uh, show and also leave the links down below. Now, since I launched my channel, I've had 4,465,053 views. Yeah, for over 4 million views. So let's break that down. How a poor man can buy cheap property made me approximately 1,283,191 views to date. Now, when I launched that video on October 11th of 2017, it's logged in, it has earned me, get this, one video, one video since uh, 2017 has earned me 17,381 dollars and 42 cents. Yep just since October 11th, 2017. Now that video has, is my most epic video. I don't have another video to compare, but I have some contenders that just recently got online. And this will give you an idea of what my audience or the general audience is looking for or just from the top 10. Not necessarily homesteading, but I do a variety of things here on, on my show 
all things homesteading, which includes repairs of various sorts and building projects of various sorts, which explains why these other videos are the top nine. Well, the number one is buying cheap property. Guess what number two is? Buying cheap property. Number two is, oh, it's not buying cheap property. Number two is something I dig tongue in cheek. Uh, a little bit of frustration there was I filmed a bit in here. And it was a uh, mysterious ghastly beast caught on trail camera. Didn't know what was eating my stuff in my greenhouse, but I decided to produce a video and laid out the uh, trail cams. And later I found out it was a vole. And uh, yeah, mysterious ghastly beast. All rodents that eat my vegetation are ghastly beasts. So I did add some other links to that show, which shows you bears and tight or in, uh, mountain lions and other uh predators so that got me so far since i uploaded that video that got me 178,701 views it's a very popular uh show that i only uploaded about a year ago yeah next show okay how i purchased a property for cheap of course here we go property again 102,316 views. Um, and now my first popular video, which is number uh, four in the list, is Farm Pond. Rid algae free using hardwood ash. Yep. That one got me 78,413 views. I'll go over how much each video um, made me in a minute. Another one is how I built a cement block foundation. That tends to be really popular, a building project show. A lot of people have complimented and commented and criticized and admonished over that one. I don't care, give me what you want. I really don't care. Another one, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ah, uh, the seventh one. For some reason, this is really popular. Yeah, building the lattice frames for the deck. Really popular video. And of course, number seven was how I built my deck. The deck, yeah, got me 54,900 or 257 views. It came in tight second on uh, the lattice framework, which was 54,952 views. As of today, can you guess what? The eighth video in my top 10 is RV repair. A lot of people have RVs and nowadays a lot of people are living in RVs. Uh, particularly the RV furnace repair blower motor removal. I go through details on that. Oh gosh, guess what? 48,889 views. Golly, folks, we'll go over the cost on how much these videos have earned me uh, since I uploaded them. Number nine, this was a recent video. I only just uploaded this maybe a month and a half, two months ago. And the question was, does Irish spring soap really repel flies? I did both the blue one and the green one. But for some reason, the blue one really caught on and took off and uh, somebody told me why. Snopes, the fact checking group, uh, used my video to prove that it doesn't work. And it doesn't work for, I proved it on the episode. The, the Irish Spring soap did not work. It just makes the place smell pretty and you gotta keep it clean, cleaned up and put fly strips out and you can catch the flies. But you got flies crawling all over the soap. They don't care. It, it just smells pretty. And uh, I know the flies are after the stench. That's what attracts them. Get rid of the attractant. And uh, Irish Spring soap, that's all it does is it helps mask the odor. But you got to keep the area clean. So how many videos or how many views did I get in that video? Well, 45,131 views in a couple of months. That's another very high producing video for that short of time. And it's up there with how a poor man can be, uh, buy cheap property, which is my number one, which has been up for a couple of years.
And then there's number 10, which is actually one of the top uh, five videos this month. And that is uh, auto mechanics, my backyard, um, what do I call it? The backyard uh, auto me backyard mechanic series. And that's replacing the fuel pump in the Chevy one ton dually. That tends to be really popular because apparently the truck is aging out and there's a lot of other folks that are dealing with the same problem I'm, I, I had and I was able to show them how I easily tilted the bed up, replaced it, got it back together, and it's all good. It's been running fine for me since. Heck, folks, I even rebuilt the transmission in that sucker by myself and I've never opened up a transmission before, but I used the University of YouTube to be able to learn how to do it. I did it, the guy was a genius in instructions, bought the um, amount of products I needed to replace and we got it in. It runs fabulous. So now being completely transparent and honest with you, I launched my YouTube video channel on July 24th, 2013. It took me a couple years to get it up to where I got enough views to be able to monetize it. Now from July 24th of 2013 to date, I've earned $31,002.18. How about that? It's a nice little extra revenue. And that's why I say it's enough revenue to pay monthly the payments on the land. I already own the house and everything on the land, but it pays for the land, the homeowner's insurance, and the property taxes. Uh, and that's what YouTube uh, monetization and videos do. But I want to point out, you never know which video is going to catch the audience attention and you, uh, get caught in the uh, algorithms and being promoted by YouTube. You just don't know. Um, I don't know. I every you know I I. I I film a lot of videos, it's my passion, my hobby, I just do it as a hobby, I'm not intending to make a whole lot of money, but it keeps me happy, I'm making a hobby, and I'm able to do some film uh, making and creating content, and then I have a wonderful audience that tunes in faithfully and watches us on our adventures, so uh, thank you guys for that. So I wanted to add that when you get, uh, you know, certain benefits from having so many subscribers, uh, you get to get into merchandising. I have merchandise right now. You can check out the store down below. Uh, this is a double insulated water bottle that I really love. I take it to work with me. It keeps things cold for a long, long time. I have two logos on this. This is my channel and I had to form a company. This is the company, Duck and a Cup Productions and because of tax reasons and stuff so keep that in mind if you're starting a youtube channel you got you if you're planning on making a lot of money it's best to do like an llc go into business but talk to a professional about that don't don't talk to me about it i'm just doing it I, i'm keeping it on the down that's why i haven't been as popular as some of you might think i should be because it's just a hobby for me. Stay tuned to more videos. You could do that by subscribing, then clicking that bell icon. That'll let you to new videos as I upload them. Also, check in. Uh, check out our new adventures. Like I'm standing here watching the grass grow. I just a did a bunch of uh, landscaping out front. Finally got the uh, lawn in. Now tomorrow I'm going to be starting the cement pathway that goes up to the door and eventually we're building a new porch so those are all new adventures uh, that may make it into the top 10 videos because they are home improvement shows yeah and also check out my series I have on the um, treasure hunting series got a bunch of stuff for free got a tractor for free got a pickup for free I got three RVs for free two boats a bunch bunch of stuff yeah check those videos out you wonder how i'm doing it free and how i bought cheap property and how i got this house i only paid 10 grand for this in our market that's a bargain did all the work myself yeah check out the show check out the videos you'll find out exactly how i did it and find out my method it's no secret some people just don't know i learned please be safe always be kind hey Click that share button. Sharing our videos on your social media platforms helps us out. Give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment. 
We'll see you guys in the next adventure. I hope this video helped you guys. Bye-bye now.